200 games. I'm obviously very proud to, to have achieved that. There's some pretty famous names that have, that have got that achievement. So um, I guess I'm, I'm very lucky to get there and uh, very proud at the same time. From the day I got here, I felt very welcomed and it, it is a very special club. And I guess Brad showed a lot of faith in me as a youngster and then really settling into a halfback role there. But when you first get here as a young kid, you sort of look to the older guys and try to figure out why they've been here a long time and um, emulate that. So Wellesley was pretty special in the midfield. Spud down back, Turbo, Scotty Thompson. Drewy up forward. Early days, I sort of looked to Boomer and, and he never missed the training session, never missed anything. So I guess I sort of try to model myself on that a bit and try to never miss a session where I can and, and just get through. And, and yeah, I suppose that's the, probably the, the biggest thing that I hang on to is being able to play with those blokes. And to be here for such a long time at a special club is something that I really take pride in. I was sort of in my fourth or fifth year and yeah, it got dropped and I was sort of like, oh, what am I doing? And I don't know if you can get complacent or not, but it was definitely a, a bit of a wake up call for me to use my assets. I wasn't really like running with the ball and probably not defending that great. So yeah, two weeks back at North Ballarat uh, was definitely a wake up call. And I remember at the time having to get up and drive to Ballarat on a Saturday morning and it was freezing and thinking, geez, I wish I was at Eddie had, but yeah, it was, it was probably what I needed at the time. So I'm uh, probably a bit more of an introverted person and that's probably the biggest thing that Shory did for me when he first got here is just challenge me to sort of get out of myself a bit and I feel like I've really been able to grow and develop as a person and a leader around the footy club and give a bit back. So yeah, that's definitely one thing that I feel like I've improved. First few years I was here, we probably didn't play too many finals and then around that 2014-15, uh, we played a big chunk of finals and um, I definitely want to get back there and I feel like we've got the group this year and yeah, sure he's been unbelievable and the, the rest of the coaching staff as well with the way they've prepared the boys this pre-season and everyone's just bought into it, the older guys that have been here for a long time and even the, the new guys that have come in, everyone's just bought into this thing that Shorey's got going and it's really starting to build and I feel like it's pretty special. I'll never be able to repay the footy club for what they've shown in me and given me and helped me develop as a person so yeah I love the place and I'll be forever grateful to the footy club.